Hi, in this class, I want us to look at multi stage sampling. Multi stage. The word you must look at for you to understand this is the word what? Multi stage. Multi stage. It is multi and it is stage. Multi stage sampling. For multi stage sampling, you have to apply more than one sampling method. It is multi. And the stage is more than one. The method too is more than one method. If you apply any of the method we discussed in another video, you apply at least two become what a multi-stage what sampling. For instance, in this population, the first thing I did here, you can see that they are what heterogeneous. What did I do? Is to what if I'm picking them according to colors. What I'm doing now, putting the red in one, color, in one box, putting the yellow in another box, putting the blue in another box, and I put this color in this box. This is what strata or called stratified. So, but each of them is a stratum, and all of them what are strata. That is the method now. This is stratified method I'm using here. After I use stratified method, I said, ah. Um, what I need to do is um, I want to cluster. I want to cluster this this one again. So how do I cluster them now? My clustering is remember I told you when it comes to clustering, you can close your eye cluster. For instance, here in this group, let me draw for you here. This is a uh, this are all red, the the okay, let me say the black group. In the bus, the yellow group in another bus. This okay. Let me use another. Sorry, let me use this one. This is a yellow. Okay, let me look at it. I was given the population, I stratify them all the yellow in a bus. Okay, I choose another color. Let me put like this. I also stratify all the black to be here in their bus. Okay. In this population too, I also choose this color. Let them be their boy. And there are only three here. And there's another color too. Let's see this color. I put them in their own boss. They were about like this. Now, what I've just done now for the entire population that was this is what stratified uh, stratified sample for now. Now, if I go further now to cluster them, remember I told you where you want to cluster, I can close my eye. It's okay, you are in one cluster. There's no reason why I'm doing that. I just decided. It's a decision I just made. No, not not in my mind. That's a cluster. Cluster one. Cluster two. They're here now. It's okay. I can say you all of you are one cluster. Why are you making all of them one cluster? I just decided to do that. Okay. Okay. This another cluster. This one now. I say you are a cluster for me. You're a cluster. I say okay. You. I will use you. I will give you only a cluster, a cluster, a cluster. So we now have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight clusters here. Now remember two methods now. The first one, I arrange them according to their colors. That's what's stratified. Now I from what I've stratified now, I close my eyes, start just marking them out, clustering them. But the point now is that what will not be my final sample? Because I'm applying cluster as the last one now. If I want to select sample now, each cluster must be a what sample. This entire cluster is a sample. One, four, it's a sample. This entire cluster, for instance, if I choose this one, the next sample now is a is a is a what? It's a it's a sample. It's a sample. A cluster is a sample when I come here. But if it was a certified method, I was using only. I cannot call. A, 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 a entire certified I can but it is not it is not a must I can just decide okay you are a sample you are a sample inside the cluster but what it is a, a cluster what is a cluster is entire 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 cluster that I will use as what well, as my sample but once you are using one more than one method we call it multi-state because it's multi-method 